Good Wednesday afternoon, EE Sports fans. This is John Cannon. I am here with this week's EE Sports.us Player of the Week, Nick Reyes. Nick finally, after the weather settled, yeah. got in his uh, playing time at the Brownsville Tournament and fared very, very well, where he placed in the top 15, I believe. Is that correct? Nick, my first question to you is how frustrating was it knowing that you had to wait an extra week due to the weather just to play? Waiting that long, I mean, I was already set. I already had a game plan into going what I was going to do. And then I was practicing all that week on my short game so I can get prepared. And then, I mean, I guess after all, I didn't, it wasn't really eager. I was, it kind of made more time so I can prepare more for that tournament. There you go. Now, going into the tournament, the weather was still kind of bad. Yeah. It was cold, a little bit rainy. So is that what you had planned for going in or? No, I didn't have a plan that into playing that weather at all. So how did you adjust? What did you do to adjust? Friday, I was not prepared at all. I mean, I wore layers of clothing, but it wasn't enough for the cold. I mean, my swing wasn't um, normal as it used to. Like, it was more tense because I was just shivering and cold in the weather. And then Saturday, I brought extra clothes. I was more prepared for the weather, weather again. And that's why I was able to shoot a little bit lower the second day. There you go. Now, how do you play a course when, when it's like that? I mean, when, when it's when it's rainy and everything, you, you know, how do you adjust your, your game and your 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 frame of mind and everything? Um, for those kind of days, I mean, your ball striking just has to be on because, I mean, the, the ground is wet and there's a lot of mud out there, so those ball striking has to be on so that, you, that way you can be able to play the same way as you usually do. That's about it. There you go. When it was all said and done and you realized, I think you placed, what, was it 12th? Is that correct? I think you placed well. I, I tied with uh, two other members. How, how happy were you despite the conditions that you did as well as you did? Mm, it could have been better. Um, triple, I tripled my last hole. I mean, it should have been a lot lower. But playing in those conditions, the way I played, and the scores I shot, I mean, it was really not that bad. It was pretty, it was a good day on those conditions. Now you've got quite a bit of a break until you start up again, so. What are you going to do during the break? Are you still going to try to stay active? Are you going to work? Yeah. From what you saw from the first half to the second half, what do you want to focus on a little more? Uh, my short game. It's, I mean, it's always been my short game. My long game has always been there. It's always been my friend. I mean, I never had to deal with distance playing golf. I've always had distance. It's just short game, working around the green, on the green, just just short game. That's all it is. You know, last question. So what are your plans for the holidays? you got two weeks off from school. What do you plan on doing? vacation for a little bit and then but while I'm on vacation I'm probably gonna take a few clubs just just so I can keep my rhythm my swing my tempo there that's about it there you go well Nick once again congratulations man on being player of the week we wish you a happy holiday and uh we'll see you again in the second half All right, thank you thank you